Yo, what is going on guys? PVZ Fabmaster here and today we are running ZMAX Sports Deck. Now, in the past few months in Plants vs. Zombies Heroes, two things have gotten a big buff. One of them is ZMAX. As you can see, they have Electro Bolt. Much better power than what he used to have and he has uh, his superpower is definitely quite a bit improved as well. But another thing that got buffed was Sports Decks. This old freaking uh, what's it called team mascot guy that used to de he used to have one uh, attack and three health. He used to like die to like berry blast or just any three attack minion. Now the only things he's really weak to are health nut and uh, what's it called whack a zombie, and those aren't very commonly used uh, cards in this game. So he's definitely like you know he's legit now. Speaking of people who are legit now, Sports Coach used to be a 2-3, now he's a 3-3, three, three, and that, that, my friend, is pretty good. Now, if you notice my pack opening, the one Galactic Legendary I have two copies of is this, oh, this guy right here, Quasar. So we're running him in this deck just for some fun. The Genetic Experiment, we're running him as some, for some fun as well. These two guys are really good turn one plays, plus there are sports cards, they have sports energy, of course you're running... The very good uh, arm wrestler plus sumo combo. These things might give us some amphibious minions because they conjure like any sports cards. They can give us maybe like a synchronized swimmer or that uh, surfer guy or whatever his name is, surfer zombie. Those guys can uh, really, uh, you know, give us some amphibious lane stuff there. Hopefully, I mean, this is Zmac, no amphibious minions, which is another one of his weaknesses. His big weakness now, of course, being that he has no hard removal, but. We got some good late game cards here. We got ourselves the also buffed All Star Zombie. He used to be a four five. Now he's a four six. We got. I'm totally saving up these sparks by the way to craft intergalactic warlords. I have almost enough gems to do a pack opening today, so I'll do another one later. And I hope I just get one of those so I get a bit of a head start because that's really the one legendary I want. And we have three copies of the good old defensive end sports energy plus an excellent finisher in the stack. So let's hop right into uh, some gameplay. And we actually are hopping right into some gameplay. Thanks for some fast matchmaking, pop, matchmaking pop cap. Let's get into it. We got a rank 44 solar flare. Better get to ultimate league soon, buddy. The clock is ticking. The clock is ticking. All right. What have we here? We have ourselves. I got rid of the ruins done. All right, that's fine. That is fine. Intergalactic. Yeah, that's not their best play against solar flare. She's got tons of early removal, but let's we'll play around Scorch in case she has that. But you know the one where everything on the ground. Ah, she has. Oh, she's going face with that. That's interesting. All right. Well, <laughs> that actually ends up taking the damage anyway. So <laughs> I forgot about that. Like, go face, and then I and then that guy takes the damage. So whatever. It doesn't even matter. It doesn't even matter. We're gonna play Sumo because we want to just get that sport. Set sports buff going on a uh, turn whatchamacallit I they could play uh the recently nerfed mushroom grotto which needed a nerf by the way it's a very OP card very OP environment actually I played it on turn two but still you know whatever uh, we play this what do we play yeah of course we play this we'll play it right here play it right there and you can shroom for two there if you want solar flare. See if I see if I care. See if I care. Once you start playing pine cloning though, that's when I get a little bit skirt. That is when I just like whoops, can't do anything about that. Who runs that? Who even runs Chomper? Oh my god. And keep in mind this is turn three, so that's not a legitimate answer to this card, by the way. It's only solar f oh, if you're any ramping, but, but come on, man. <laughs> come on, man, as Fry em Up would say. Come on, and we're going to run another gladiator, just totally protecting ourselves. You can't touch this, man. We got ourselves a mini soul patch on the board. Two mini soul patches. One is damaged, but whatever. See if I care. And this thing is going to buff it because, I don't know, solar flare is, well, no real way of bu buffing Chomper, so... Ah, oh, but I hope Punish Room doesn't punish our poor little chicken imp. That's still what I like to call it, not sports imp or team mascot. He's chicken imp because he's freaking. Oh no! The buff shroom value. It's sad. 
All right, well, we still got this guy for finish it. See, the thing about this deck is Z another, as if, as if Z-Mac did need another weakness. It's, um, another one is he doesn't have a lot of good ways to draw cards, but we're running those Quasar Wizards to hopefully get some neat superpowers, and we're running those, uh, what's your call it's running the, uh, the, the, that, that, that guy, that exact guy, the, the Cosmic Sports Team Star, whatever the frick his name is, to draw some cards as well, but <laughs> sometimes you end up running, ooh, Pogo Bouncer, let's get it, let us get it. Ah, uh, we don't have enough room for that. That's much better here, though, honestly. This is, like, a lot better. We're going to save up for that, and we're going to pogo next turn. Because we want this to just do freaking get die, you know? We'll see if he has Pine Clone. If he has Pine Clone, that freaking sucks. Whatever. So, we're running that guy for card draw. We're running uh, Quasar for card draw, because... And it's all about RNG, but, you know, it's some kind of card draw. Oh my gosh. And, I don't know if this guy realizes it, but Sonic Bloom, it does one damage collectively. And this armored one, it obviously reduces their damage by one. One minus zero is zero, and it's one attack. It's one. I, I don't know if I can explain it that great, but it's like one five times, but it's only counted as one all five of those times. And, by the way, that's some... Really good board clear right there. And we're just going to get rid of uh, this guy. We don't want him buffing any mushroom stuff. So that was just an excellent of example of how a Z-Mech Super can be pretty OP now. Because I just cleared his board. He was getting all the tempo, all that good stuff. And I was like, rip. So we're going to do that. And we're going to do this as well. Cover up that environment. See, if you can't get an Amphibious minion from uh, the sports thing, uh, Pogo Bouncer could be even good, even better for uh, Z-Mac here. Who's looking pretty evil. You can see that on his like little robot thing over there. Come on, Solar Flare, make your play. You want to get to Ultimate or what, Solar Flare? Don't disconnect. I wants to win. I wants to beat you. Well, maybe you'll win if you don't disconnect. All right, here we go. We got ourselves a mushroom. Mushroom is in the house. We, we might. Oh Jesus! It'd take you that long to make that play? Thought that play would be relatively obvious, but okay, maybe not. Wait, don't turn that. Oh my gosh, that turns into a pine clone. I still have no idea how that works, but whatever. And we're just gonna go face, cause that's that's the that's the life we live. Gotta go face. Gotta go face. Excuse me. When we're playing against the harsh pine clone deck like this, we just ah, thank God we rolled a one. That's very good. And we're gonna lightning bolt you. Do some damage prevention. And we're looking, okay, ah, we're going to defensive end, then defensive end the next turn. Eventually, we'll just wear him down. Guess that's what we got to go with at this point. Oh my gosh, rest in peace to poor Pogo Bouncer. No, I think we could be screwed here unless we roll really well. Come on, roll good. No. <laughs> no. I thought we were going to get a disconnect, and then all of a sudden, Pine Clone, rest in peace to you. <laughs> this deck actually isn't that great, but we're going to give it one or two more shots, so it's all, it's all good. It's all good. Alrighty then. Giving the ZMAX Sports deck another try. We going to get a fast match again? Come on, Popcat. There we go. Hooking me up with a rank frog boy. This is probably going to be another heal deck. So it's like a pine clone deck and a heal deck, which are, you know, the he <laughs> pine clone decks used to be the most OP and now it's heal deck. So rest in peace, pretty much. Alrighty then. So what have we here? We have... I think this is literally the same starting hand I ended up with the last time, or, or at least it's pretty close to it. We're going to mulligan that out. That's fine. Alright. 
we're gonna play this guy right here. And uh, Wall Knight doesn't have that really good early hard removal, so it's actually this guy's actually gonna be really good at protecting us. Like uh, that Morning Glory. Yep, no damage to my, no damage to my face. We did one to him, but he rolled a three. That kind of sucks. Do we wait for him to maybe play an environment and then cover it? I think we do. Let's see if he's like, I don't know, wants one. Oh, he's playing that thing. Interesting. Should I? Uh, we got plays next turn. We got plays. All right. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Gladiator is dead now, so we better start worrying about maybe doing one of these things, or I don't know. We're gonna move a plant. We gonna put, we gonna sumo him up, and then we're probably gonna missile madness. Oh, come on, man! Come on, man! This is sad. Well, actually, what do we do here? Probably just do this. Save the missile madness for a better time. We got the most clutchest one I've definitely ever had in that last game, but didn't pay off at the end. Ooh, that's a good one. That's a good thing to top deck. What have we here? What do we got, Mr. Uh, Cosmic Sports Star? Ooh, another defensive end. That's good. Uh, do we save up for this? I think we do. All right, that's good. That's actually good here, I think. If he plays some more juicy little minions, we're just going to be like, rip. Ah, that's not juicy enough. Tell you what, though, we're gonna do that. Get that damage in. Put a little damage on the Starch Lord. And, uh, won't be that bad. Oh, of course, he won't get that damage in because he freaking rolled a bunch of threes, but whatever. Couldn't roll like that towards the end of that Pine Clone game. Just rest in peace. You're done. <laughs> an example of my bad luck in this game but uh, then again that that pine clone deck it's not gonna that pine clones are still pretty much tier one decks this is a tier two deck it's a it's a pretty fun tier two deck but it's a tier two deck nonetheless and we are gonna bring the bring the pressure with this little def not little big big defensive end we could have maybe done that and that, but I don't, I don't want to play the defensive end at this point, you know? It's all about that defensive end. I mean, what is he? Oh, of course, Wall Knight has ways of dealing it with. He's, a, he's the main dude that could deal with that. He's got the sham rockets, he's got the squashes, but nah, he's not. he doesn't have anything there, you know? So, we're looking all right here. He's going to heal back up, but... Oh, boy. Yeah, Power Flowers. Oh my god, that card is OP. Uh, we're gonna do this. Let's make all those tricks cost more so like he can't get rid of these defensive ends at this point. Because the tricks just... I mean, Doom Shroom is at freaking 9 now. So like, good luck, man. Shamrocket is at 3 plus 2 plus 2, 7. So you mean, you know... All right, he's doing that thing, but we're probably gonna block. So we're looking, we're looking like to be, in, we're looking to be in good shape here. Come on, block! Don't freaking! Oh my god! How is it that I keep rolling ones and he keeps rolling all these freaking, you know, not one? He keeps rolling lucky and I keep rolling like I don't know, crap. Uh, do we play this or this? I'm gonna try and get an amphibious minion. Come on. Synchronized Swimmer. <laughs> Synchronized Swimmer. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, that's actually pretty good, too, but we got to wait to play it now. Oh, I can't believe he freaking rolled a it's So stupid. He, like, rolled a bunch of threes to start of the game, and we just roll a freaking one. I mean, come on, man. We probably got this game in the bag, but still. We might not. I mean, he could just play a heart of choke, and he probably wins, actually. What, am I, what do I mean he's got this game in the bag? He probably won. All of the hard choke can, you know, heal him out. Whatever. I don't know. I don't know. That's the point. I don't know anything. All I know is I have defensive ends on the board. Whoa, Gravitry. I've never had that card be played against me. It seems like a very eh kind of card. 
It's like, okay, that's a super rare. I could see it. it's got good stats and everything, but... Eh. Eh. Ooh. This is very good here, actually. I was saying ooh to that as well, but that is very good. Maybe we should have played that. We probably should have played that. Oh my gosh, he's using the freaking... Walnut Superpower, I swear to God, is the most annoying one in the entire game. And now he's freaking Stalin. Stalin Knight, as I like to call him. He's just Stalin as usual, man. Alright, I think we might have him here, though. Four damage, six damage. What would it take? He didn't pretty much all his powers, though, help. You know, healing. and Oh, wait, I forgot. He just protected himself. I'm such an idiot. So, yeah. He just protected himself anyway. And now we don't have a play, so... Hooray! Might have a rolling stone play, but, you know. Who even knows? Who even freaking knows? Come on, give me some. Oh, there we go. That's something juicy. That's something nice and juicy. Oh, God. That's a value play right there, my friend. That is a valuable play. Doom Shroom value is kicking in. <laughs> Once those defensive ends go off the board, doesn't become as pricey. Doesn't become as pricey. All right. Well, we got ourselves some plays here. That's for sure. We're going to use this here. Give me something good. Give me a synchronized swimmer. Oh, another one of these things. All right. Why not? Give me something juicy. Give me a synchronized swimmer. Play this thing though. All right, Cosmic Sports Stars, let's do it. Let's get it. Yeah, yeah, boy. And these are all three attack minions, mind you. So, no Doom Shroom in here, my friend. No Doom Shroom. Okay. Hey, you know what that is though? That right there is a defensive Walnut Bowling. Not an offensive walnut bowling, a defensive one. And defensive walnut bowlings suck. Because you're looking for that as like, oh yeah, I could finish him off now. Just freaking walnut bowling him in the face. But now he's, all, now he's got to be all damage control. Like, oh, I can't walnut bowling him in the face. Now I just got to uh, be a damage control person. Mm, it sucks. But what we're going to do here, <laughs> I don't know why I did that voice, but. We're gonna do this. Oh, we should have played it that or I forgot the freaking uh, frenzy environment it would have given him extra attack. I'm so dumb. Okay, we're gonna do this. And this. Have fun dealing with that board wall night. Let's see if you have another Doom Shroom. You probably do, just because I know that's my luck. Or some sham rockets or any sort of hard removal, because I know you've got hard removal up the wazoo, my friend. You got everything you need to remove some pesky old zombies off the board, and you have that as well, so, you know. <laughs> Z-Mac can't deal with that, my friend. Z-Mac doesn't deal with that shit. He's not very good at dealing with that. God. You know what I wish I had now? Like, I don't know, rocket science or like a good card that will, I don't know, remove that off the board? I mean, jeez, man. I try to play as like a ZMAX sports deck, but it just it just don't work, man. It just don't work. We need to have a huge comeback here. God, I hate that soul patch now. I hate it. I hate it. Makes me loathsome. Uh, that won't even get value out of that. What am I supposed to do here, honestly? What the frick am I supposed to do? This frickin' soul patch is on the board. Zemek has no way of dealing with that because PopCap refuses to give him, you know, an actual good card to do that. And that just frickin' sucks. That's how that is. Yeah. Just absolutely stupid, honestly. Like, so purchase on the board, it's so freaking stupid! Uh, God, it's getting me all triggered and everything. How am I supposed to deal with this card? 
How am I supposed to deal with this freaking car? God! <sighs> Soul Patch, you suck, man. You suck. You're not even that good of a legendary. Like, any hero can take you out except this one. <sighs> You're not even that good of a legendary, buddy. You just suck at life. Alright, I, I, we're still... We're still fine here, I mean, in terms of staying alive. It's just that he's got that annoying card on the board. We can win, but we'll probably win by, like, turn 20 if we do win at all. So get that bullseye value on the board. Get the sports coach. Ooh, yeah. Looking pretty good. But that soul patch is triggering me. Beyond triggering. It's just triggering me. It's making me angry. It's making me, uh, making me a little sad. Making me a little sad. Why is he using that there? Chump block? Okay. He just, he's just damage control knight. He doesn't want any freaking damage taken to him. Oh, that thing is great here, actually. Some armored on that, uh, whatchamacallit, the freaking all-star zombie. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm talking about. Unfortunately, that's not going to break through this turn. He's got that freaking thing, the freaking power flower card that I, fr that I hate. Like, too much, probably. Well, I only hate it now because it's being an annoying, but, you know. Hey, being annoying is a reason to hate it, you know. Oh uh, boy, I he's got dickweed now too, and it's just great. The almighty dickweed. Come on, this is so annoying. I don't like going up against these freaking troll knight decks. Ah, jeez, uh, man. Ring! Soul Patch, I hate you. I hate you, Soul Patch, you're so mean. Alright, we're just gonna... I don't know. Genetic experiment. Hooray. Well, you know what I'm gonna do for this guy? I'm gonna concede. We will play one more game with this deck. And if I lose, I will officially say, Zmac, you suck. I need to play sports decks with another dude. You know what I haven't seen yet? It's making me kind of pissed. Quasar Wizard. Maybe we'll see this in the last game. Because even if I win this last one, I mean, I, got, I went 1 and 2 today, which which just sucks. So, you know. I don't like going 1 and 2. Oh, we got a rank 30 on our hands, so, you know. Alright, so. Got ourselves a rank 30. And, uh, put the, yeah, we keep that. And, uh, so it's a very zoo like starting hand, so. We're gonna play that. Yep. Alrighty then. So. Lots of cards here we can play. We'll, we'll, we'll play this, of course, though. Arm Wrestler plus Sumo. Good combination. Oh, he's playing around it, huh? We're just going to move that over there, then. All right. So we got our little cards on the board now, and... This is definitely the last game I'm playing. I mean, hopefully I actually win for once, you know? Got we got ourselves a genetic experiment right here. He's looking fabulous. You're running freaking Snow Pea? Well, you're rank three, so, you know, whatever. You can run Snow Pea if you want. You can run some good old Snow Peas. And by good ol' I mean, uh, bad. Takes the genetic experiment out, so whatever. 
get some value. This thing's a 4-3 now. That's a menace. 4-2. Well, basically a 4-3 because it has armor. What do we got? Ooh. Chicken Imp. Yeah. I think we might be finally seeing that sports value, guys. Alright, so this thing. Next turn. Oh. Repeater takes that. Oh my god, no. <laughs> oh. Why? Oh, yeah, well, that thing freaking dies now. No. That would have died without the buff, too. Oh, we're going to play Quasar. I was just, compl I've been complaining that we haven't seen the Quasar value, so let's get it. What have we here, Mr. Quaid? Ooh, that might actually be good here. This is normally a pretty bad power to get, but if it takes this out, I'll be happy. Alright, so Green Shadow's just taking her time here. We're gonna hit her we're gonna hit her with the dolphin, I think. One time I got freaking gravestone power from Quasard and then I and then I just powered it with that. Oh my god, we need to take... This thing needs to bounce this. Oh my god, please. 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 <laughs> Thank you. God. Oh my god. That almost turned out to be really bad. <laughs> Thank you, Quasar. Thank you for saving us. Quas... Is it Quas... I still don't know if it's Quasar. 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 It's just Quasar. I don't know. Please get my Quasar, thank you. It got my Quasar, yes. More value. But do we want to play this though? Well, we want to play this. We obviously want to play this. I mean, Quasar's the fun play, but this is the logical play. So we'll do that, and we'll do this. Come on. Come on. There we go. We'll play Quasar if he removes one of these. And we can have some fun. Get some more awesome superpowers. And I wanted to say that I got a little gravestone superpower from that. So I literally got to get another power. And then I ended up getting Professor Brainstorm's Eureka power. Which was just... It was lit. Oh my god. Freaking... This guy's using like fertilizer and stuff. See here's where we get the fun from Quasar. He's at 2 health. But like I want to keep getting stuff from this Quasar guy. I want to keep getting stuff. All right, this is the smart play, obviously, but we're going with Quasar, fam. <laughs> we're going with Quasar. We got, oh, Smash's superpower. That actually might have been the smart play then. We got Smash's superpower. It's not going to take that out, but we'll take out almost anything else you play. Like, Smash's superpower could take out, like, Wintermelon and freaking laser beam it just takes out like everything takes out even big minions is what i'm trying to say it takes out big stuff it takes out the big boys yeah we're gonna smash that we're gonna smash we turn it into the smash let's go and just roll one for uh, some happy ending no okay cool i still we still got guaranteed lethal so it's all right yeah you attack for that five damage so whatever Awesome. Awesome. All right, so I wanted to end the game with a win, and more importantly, some Quasar value, and we got exactly that. So I hope you guys enjoyed, even though this deck kind of sucked. Uh, see you next time. This is PVZ Fabmaster. Bye-bye.